When I came to Siemens in 2007, a huge corruption investigation had been started by the German authorities. There's this a misunderstanding. People think that it was the SEC or the Department of Justice from the United States that started. It was really the German authorities that started the case. 200 German policemen showed up on our doorstep in, in November 2006. I came in the following year to help try and fix things. What we discovered was that there had been a deviation from first principles. Werner von Siemens, who started our company, wrote in his memoirs written in 1860 that he'd been tempted by corru corruption in building Siemens, his own company, and refused to participate. And with those guiding values, Siemens prospered for decades. Um, we lost our way. And it was finding our way back that was important. First, we had to change a number of things. But mostly, we had to give our own employees the, the, the support, the encouragement, the tools to say no. And the interesting and most interesting part of our story is, now that we say no to corruption, we are more successful than ever before. Market share is up. Margins are up. Profitability is up. 2011 was our record year in our entire 165-year history. So clean business is good business.